So I hope these techniques help you along the way to play Menta song. Hey guys, how are you doing? It's your guy Oshen here. I'm here to break down five mental techniques today. And here we go. You guys was wondering how I play that. So we are in the key of G and the progression is one, five, two, five, one. And here we go. So first, you tap, then you pluck. You tap, you pluck. We are in the two, you tap, then you pluck. We go back to the five, you tap, then you pluck. So I hope you all get that. So it's one, you tap, then you pluck. Five, you tap, you pluck. The two, you tap, then you pluck. And the fifth, we tap, then we pluck. So it's on like. I hope you guys get that. Okay, the second one, we're in the key of G, so we're gonna work with G for today. So it's an octave, so it's so like. So you play this. So we are playing a low octave and we are playing a high octave. So you can, you can slide and on the high octave, you can slide from the dominant seven to the one. So it's on like. I hope you guys catch that. And the third one, we gonna we gonna slide and we're gonna pop, then pluck. So you slide, and it's better you slide with the more fleshy part of your hand. When you do that, you get a smooth slide. So when you slide with, 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 with this part, you get a smooth slide. So now we're gonna slide, pat, then we pluck. So. So I hope you guys get that. So you slide, you pat two times, then pluck. So you can you can you can you can pat with two fingers, three fingers, four fingers. But I pat with four fingers. Whatever you're comfortable with, you can pat with it. So I pat with four fingers and slide with the fleshy part of my hand, which is here. So I go like this. Then pluck, top, slide, top, pluck. Thank you. So we go to the fourth one. So the fourth one is you're gonna you go, you're only gonna pat and pluck. So you can pat two times and you can pat three times. So here we go. So we're still in the key of G. So we're gonna stay on the one. So in this case, mental song is singing. You can you can you can go like this. So okay, we're gonna triple that. So here we go. So we're gonna play it back over. So you can pat on the fretboard and you can pat over the pickups. So what, whichever you're comfortable with, you can pat on the fret and you can pat over the pickups. I do it vice versa. Sometimes I pat here, sometimes I pat here. So here we go again. Okay, we're gonna do the one for the pickups now. So you can pat here. Okay. And the fifth one, it's similar to the fourth one, but what are we gonna do with the fifth one now? We're gonna slide from the dominant seventh and go to the one. And we call it the flat seven also. So here we go. So we're gonna pat two times and we're gonna pat three times. So we're gonna make it double, we're gonna make it triple. So here we go. Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna make it triple now. We're gonna triple that. Mean we're gonna triple the top. You triple the top, you double the top, or you can triple the top. So here the triple now. And what I do sometimes, while doing that on the low octave, sometimes I bring it down to the high octave. So it sounds something like this. So you can mix it up to make it more dynamic. So sometimes you play it on the low octave and then sometimes you can, you can just fill, in it, fill it with um, a high octave. So I heard it, I know you heard that. So you got like this. So I hope these techniques help you along the way to play Menta Song. Thank you.